Hello and welcome, Catherine here. I've been working with people suffering from kidney problems for 10 years. And there is no doubt that following the correct diet is essential to improve kidney function. There are 7 foods that are so good for your blood circulation that will help you fight swelling, fluid retention, high blood pressure, and diabetes. Yes, the right diet is the cornerstone of any kidney restoring plan that works and these foods will actually help improve blood vessel strength and reduce plaque buildup in your arteries. And that's great to lower your creatinine levels. And guys, when I tell you that you can heal your kidneys with a diet, I actually mean it. Patients in stage 3 and 4 were able to stop kidney disease progression and in some cases restore some of their kidney function by eating more fruit and vegetables. And you can do it too with the 7 superfoods of today's video. Our number one in particular is so rich in antioxidants and phytochemicals that you will directly improve your kidney function by increasing your blood circulation. Amazing! But before that, let's start with a tasty fruit which is so rich in polyphenol antioxidants and nitrates, which are potent vasodilators, that some people are even able to swap their blood pressure medications for it. I'm talking about number seven, pomegranate. Pomegranate is a juicy, sweet fruit that's great to improve blood flow and oxygenation of tissue in the kidneys, according to studies. And this fruit is especially effective on blood pressure. In a recent study on kidney patients, those who eat this food daily were able to lower their blood pressure at the point that they didn't need blood pressure medications anymore. Just remember, if you eat pomegranate, never discard the pith. The yellow pith you can see here, which is really bitter, is also the part that makes this fruit an incredible healing superfood. Now you may ask, if pomegranate is so healthy, why is it only number 7 in our top 7? Well, unfortunately, this fruit also comes with the longest list of interactions a food can have. What to do then? You may consider avoiding this one, but its health benefits are so powerful, it may be worth eating it as far away as possible from any medication you may be taking. Usually, two or three hours before or after taking medications, she'll be fine and you will be getting a lot of health benefits for your blood circulation. So, question. Why you should care about your blood circulation if you have kidney disease? Proper circulation is key for improving kidney health. It helps to heal wounds faster, it keeps your brain sharp, it keeps your heart healthy. And improving blood circulation is especially important if you are suffering from complications of CKD such as fluid retention and swelling in your arms and legs. These complications are directly caused by poor circulation and can improve with a better diet. And let's not forget that also ED is caused by poor blood circulation. The foods and tips of today's video are all aimed at making the blood vessels less narrow and stiff, allowing every organ to function better. The kidneys will benefit the most since having better circulation is directly linked to less blood pressure and better kidney function. Time now to see our number 6 for today. This is absolutely a must for kidney health. Our number 6 comes with no side effects and it's also very low in potassium and phosphorus. Not to mention that this food also has a long list of health benefits for the kidneys and blood vessels. Before I'll show you what it is, I want to say thanks to Ridge for sponsoring today's video. I've been using the Ridge wallet for almost a month now and I think it's awesome. Not going back to my old wallet, the Ridge wallet can fit into your pocket better than anything else and it still holds up to 12 cards plus cash. 
it's RFID blocking to protect you from digital pickpocketers. And the other reason why I believe this wallet is worth every penny is the lifetime warranty. Actually, at Ridge, they're so confident in the product, they're offering 45 days money back. No questions asked if you for some reason don't like it. And guys, if you use my code OKINI at checkout, you will also receive 10% discount on any purchase on Ridge.com. So check the link down in the description for a 10% discount. Time now to see our number 6 for today, even healthier than pomegranate. This is a forbidden food with a hidden health benefit. Number 6. Red currants. Oh, a food as healthy as misunderstood. These little berries are a must in a renal diet for their taste, the fact that they are really nutrient dense and most importantly for their powerful medicinal properties. Red berry fruits such as red currants have been used for centuries to cure a wide range of problems such as dysentery, stomach ailments, scurvy, and rheumatism, but several recent studies have focused primarily on their effects on the arteries. Red currants are particularly rich in anthocyanins, the compounds which give the berries their red, purple, and blue pigments, which can help protecting the arteries. And this incredible powerhouse also has kidney healing benefits. It provides powerful anti-inflammatory and detoxing benefits, especially for the urinary tract. Red currant even boasts some stress-reducing properties. Consuming this tart berry may help decreasing cortisol production, very important for the health of your kidneys. What not many people know about red currants is that this plant was wrongly accused in 1990s of spreading a fungus that killed pines. And the US government banned the cultivation just to unban it a few years later. What this means is that today, the majority of Americans can only enjoy frozen or dried red currants, which is not so bad considering that you will still get the health benefits. But you will be missing their tarty, delightful taste. Time now for what is probably the most controversial food in existence. Our number 5 is a fruit, but everyone considers it a veggie. It's very healthy, it's good for the kidneys and the circulation. And yet, probably no dietitian ever has recommended this one to a kidney patient. But they may be wrong. I'm talking about number five, tomato. <laughs> I bet you guys already know that tomatoes are the on the do not or limit foods lists of many websites. But did they ever tell you how healthy this incredibly misunderstood food actually is? Tomatoes may help reduce the activity of angiotensin converting enzyme or ACE, which causes blood vessels to constrict and to increase blood pressure. Have you ever heard about ACE inhibitor drugs? They work just like that. They reduce the activity of angiotensin converting enzyme and this directly opens up your blood vessels and improves blood flow. Studies note that tomato extract can inhibit ACE, reduce inflammation, and disrupt platelet aggregation. And that's amazing for better kidney health and circulation. But obviously, there is a problem with tomatoes. They're also pretty rich in potassium. One medium-sized tomato contains around 260 milligrams of potassium. It's around the same potassium you will get from a large-sized apple, which is not really that much. Just avoid using pre-made tomato sauce. And while only your doctor can tell you if adding 260 milligrams of potassium to your diet is dangerous for you, new research is questioning the link between dietary potassium and serum potassium. In blood. Yes, some researchers believe that the potassium you eat has nothing to do with the potassium in your blood. More info in my video up here watching now to know more. You may discover that many foods you use to avoid are safe. Okay, time now for our number four. This food is usually seen as a tasty snack, but it's actually so rich in antioxidants, it may even prevent heart disease and cancer. 
I'm talking about. Number four, walnuts. And they're particularly healthy for the kidneys because while you may get this heart benefit from other nuts too, walnuts are also very low in potassium compared to other nuts. Packed with nutrients such as vitamin E and L-arginine nuts, such as the walnut, work to promote your body's production of nitric oxide. Containing high levels of amino acids as well as magnesium and calcium, nuts can help lower your blood pressure as well as reduce inflammation. This is particularly helpful with kidney disease. Just don't overeat them. To get the benefits, you only need to eat few nuts per day. A simple trick to get the best from walnuts. In walnuts and other nuts, most of the antioxidant and vitamin content is in the pellicle, the skin of the walnut. So, don't buy skinless walnuts or peeled almonds. Time now to see the green with the highest content of nitrates you can find. Number three is bok choy. This is a type of cabbage with so many health benefits. Out of the cabbage family, bok choy is the highest in nitrates. We can basically consider it a better alternative to spinach when it comes to improved blood circulation. And bok choy is also lower in potassium than spinach, making it ideal for the kidney diet. Bok choy can be found either in the large or baby variety and both can be eaten either raw, in a salad or cooked. And guys, if you cannot find this one, there are many other greens that are high in nitrates and that are great for your blood circulation. Lettuce is almost as rich in nitrates as bok choy and a lot easier to find. Okay, time now to see the king of foods rich in nitrates. Consuming this one regularly is a must for someone with kidney disease or diabetes. Our number three is so powerful as a fast day later. There are studies showing it can lower blood pressure by up to 10 over 5 millimeters of mercury. I'm talking about number two, beet. Oh, I love eating beets or beetroots depending on where you live. And this sweet root is so good for your kidneys and circulation because it is incredibly rich in nitrates. Your body converts nitrates into nitric oxide, which in turn relaxes blood vessels and increases blood flow to organs and tissues. And this root is number two in today's top seven because it has an impressive list of health benefits. It fights the inflammation in the body, it supports gut and brain health, it makes you more energized, and it is proven by science to help lower your blood pressure. If you want your kidneys to improve, you want to make this one a regular on your table. And what a better way of doing this than trying my recipe for a tasty smoothie full of healing ingredients. Mm. I'll share this recipe in my video up here. Watch it now to know more. Okay, now time for our number one. This is probably the most powerful anti-inflammatory food on earth. It was also used for centuries by traditional medicine to open blood vessels and improve blood circulation. I'm talking about number one, turmeric. Increased blood flow is one of turmeric's many health benefits. This is all thanks to the curcumin in turmeric. This natural compound greatly helps increase nitric oxide production. In a study taking 2000 mg of curcumin daily for 12 weeks led to a 37% increase in forearm blood flow and a 36% increase in upper arm blood flow, which is frankly amazing! Using turmeric as a spice and adding it to salads and veggies is great, but if you really want to benefit from turmeric, you need to eat it in smoothies or to drink it in golden milks. I have a recipe up here with powerful healing properties you may want to know more about. And this is all for today. Thank you for watching.